Cryptic here and welcome to a Tuesday tutorial number 14. Da -da -da -da! Yes, and I have been indulging my interest in my croppers. Sorry to you guys that aren't interested, but we will move on from it eventually. But for those of you who are my croppers obsessed like me or about to be, here we are going to look at um, some of the vehicles that I have built in my Acropolis scale. Of course it's not an exhaustive list of um, things that I've built in my Acropolis for vehicles but these are just the ones that I could easily get my hands on. <laughs> okay so we've got a few different vehicles here that range from regular sort of family cars through to bigger things. I do also have trucks on some of my blocks but they're actually uh, physically attached to my blocks, so I can't get them without actually unpacking the blocks as well. Never mind, we'll get to them eventually. So here we have a uh, little lorry or truck or a van, whatever takes your fancy. There's the 1x3 plate, a 1x2 plate, a 1x1 one one clear plate, that could also be a tile if you liked and a grill plate on top very basic very simple it gives you an idea of like a um, contractors van or something like that this one's similar again just with some alternating colors so we've got one by three one by two then I have tinted windows woo how sexy are those uh, with a, a cheese slope there instead of the plate that we used over on that one and a very shiny chrome looking uh, grill plate on top so um, I quite like this one this one's quite um, nice very nice and if you were really tricky you could probably make a little logo and put it on there if you had very steady hands the logo on the side of it Okay, this is one of my favourites. It's uh, very similar to ambulances around here in Queensland. So we've got a 1x3 plate again, 1x2 plate, a 1x2 jumper plate, a clear cheese slope, and then we have a trans red tile round on top. So that's a little ambulance. Wee -wee -wee -wee. This one here is supposed to look like a uh, fire truck. It's fire trucks are red usually. So you have a 1x3 plate on the bottom, 1x2 one, one plate, then the 1x2 jumper plate with a stud on top, clear cheese slope for the front windscreen, and then a square trans clear red on top of it. So that's like a little, um, like the, the van type fire trucks or um, the ones that go to, not, not the big ones with the ladders, but like the little, the little fire uh, vehicles moving right along. Now um, this one here is just a very basic um, school bus. Um, yellow being something that's more American but uh, school buses over here in um, my state are all pretty much the same colors as the buses that um, normal you know people normally get on so there's nothing to designate a school bus and because I have a school in my Micropolis I need a school bus so yeah most people recognize this as being a school bus because of popular culture so you've just got a one by four in this yellow. It's not um, yellow yellow, it's the uh, bright yellow. Then you've got a couple of clear, trans clear uh, plates in between. This will ever focus on it for me. <laughs> and then a, a tile on top. So really simple, nothing too fancy. Gives the impression well enough. Then getting down to your basics, 
the uh, basic car is just a 1x2 jumper plate with the stud on top and a 1x1 tile. So that is a car. I like to be a bit silly and I make the tile pieces on top a different colour to the rest of the car because I think one colour cars are boring. So I have a very <laughs> rainbow warrior um, vehicle uh, yeah, uh, transportation in my city. And this is another, another way that you can make a car is that you can put a clear, trans clear on top of a tile. You can also use a cheese slope, but I tend to use, keep the cheese slopes for my speed boats that are in my bay section of my city. So that's some basics. <laughs> some basics of um, my vehicles in my city. Now these, um, most of these are all kept loose. Uh, my ambulances and fire uh, little fire units go and there's usually um, like some kind of a car pile up in my city because we have some fun at shows in fact I um, I invite some of the other guys that we show with to come along and uh, help me put out the vehicles and I say to them look I want to have a car accident um, I also have some little police cars oh I didn't pull one of those out uh, which is just a little white jumper plate with a blue round um, little tile on top of it. So I'll have like the police, you know, cutting off each one of the rows and uh, a car pile up and there'll be an ambulance or a fire fire unit there in attendance <laughs> coming along. Nee, 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 nee. And um, yeah, it's, it's always fun to add a bit of life to your city. I don't have like little people because people are generally indicated by two studs high, children one stud high. Generally, I don't have people in my city, but I like to have a nice variety of vehicles. So there you go, guys. Um, what do you think? Are you going to add some vehicles to your Micropolis city? Uh, what sort of vehicles do you think you'll make? Um, I've seen other people make like trucks and tow trucks and all sorts of interesting bits and pieces. Um, I actually have a concrete mixer truck as well on one of my blocks. I have at least one or two trucks that are making deliveries at shops on my blocks. Yeah, there's so many different vehicles that you could choose to make. You just need to get in, get inspired by what's in the bottom of your Lego box with all those little bits and pieces and just have a play. Put stuff together and see what comes out of it and by all means, you know, get creative, have fun doing it, don't be so serious. You don't have to be so serious about making a mock, it doesn't have to be perfect. It just needs to make your heart sing. So. Keep on building guys, I will see you another day, get inspired, and I will see you next time. Woo!